The double slit interference pattern use red light wavelength 700 nanometers with a fringe spacing X. Which fringe spacing will be observed for the same apparatus but using blue light, different wavelength? There is one equation for interference. That is lambda equals to AX over D. Um, we are changing the, the light, right? So the apparatus is the same. Same arrangement, same apparatus. That means if I look at my equation, the A and the D are constant. What are those things again? Oh, yeah. Double slit is like this. The wave come in. The wave overlap. The waveform pattern on the screen. Bright fringe, bright fringe. We call this fringe spacing. Distance to screen, we call D. Distance between slits, we call A. So we can conclude that if everything is kept constant, lambda is proportional to X. So let's do a ratio. We start off with red light. So I can say, okay, 7.0 times 10 negative 7 over X, 3.5 mm. I'm going to keep it in mm because we're doing ratio, so we can kind of cheat a bit. Okay. Uh, by the way, what I'm doing here is that uh, from this, I can conclude that lambda over x is constant. So whatever ratio I get here should be equal to when I use blue light. Oh. Blue light, the wavelength is different. So 4.5 times 10, negative 7. What is the fringe, is it fringe spacing? Fringe spacing in millimeter. This one, press calculator, I should get 2.25. Millimeter. The so best choice is A, 2.3, if I round it off. So stay calm if you don't have enough information. Like, oh, miss, they never give A, they never give D. That means you can probably do a ratio. We can't find that. Or you can calculate AD and then you plug in again. Can also, whatever method you want to use. Alright, so that's all for this double slit question.